The trial series has always been known for having some pretty cool easter eggs. I mean, who could forget the penguin tennis easter egg in Trials Fusion? So with Trials Rising releasing this week, I decided to showcase 15 of my favourite easter eggs, secrets and references I've found so far. Oh and because I don't want it to distract from the video, yes my character is modelled after Waluigi. Also if you found any easter eggs or secrets that you think I may have missed, then the best place to contact me is on my Twitter or Instagram. The links to both will be in the description and in my pinned comment. Anyway without further delay, let's get started. So up first we have something that Ubisoft does in all of its games, and that's reference their other games. On the lights camera action stage you can find this. So in the dumpster you can spot a blood dragon poster and the cat on a unicorn bike is a bike you can unlock in the awesome level mix DLC for Trials Fusion. Up next we're heading to the frozen fjord level which contains a couple of cool easter eggs. The first one is this. So reversing at the beginning of the level will allow you to wear a snowman head for the rest of the track or until you crash whichever comes first. The next secret location is found at checkpoint 9. So going down the chimney allows you to drop in on these three guys. One of my favourite things in video games is fourth wall breaks. For those that don't know, a fourth wall break is when a piece of media acknowledges the viewer or player. Deadpool is a great example of this and one of my favourite examples in video games is this from The Evil Within 2. I'm in the middle of some serious shit right now O'Neill. I could use some help out there. No way. Are you kidding? Do you know how long it took me to come back here to talk to you about this? You could have just called you know. Are you coming with me or not? I told you I wasn't going to leave this place. It's fucking evil out there. That may be, but there's evil within too. Trials Fusion has its own fourth wall break too, which can be heard by sitting still on any of the University of Trials training levels. Do you find the University of Trials so interesting that you put the controller down and walk away? Well, if so, I have heaps more content online. Now I don't think I can say the company names here, so let's just say you have to do a something search for the University of Trials and then go to a popular video sharing site where you'll see hundreds more videos that you can start watching and then completely ignore. What are you doing? What could possibly be more important than your trials education? Hey, I'm trying to teach you something here, so the least you could do is pay attention. Listen, I don't get paid to sit around here all day waiting for... What? Sorry, what, what's that? I do get... Oh, that's fine. Carry on. I, I keep getting paid regardless. I, I, w I wonder if... I wonder if they're coming back. Do, do you think I can grab a drink real quick? Look, if, if they come back, just cover for me, okay? I started the University of Trials in 2013, and ever since then, I've been trying to teach people how to become better writers. I'm so excited to get the opportunity to do this from within the game that I wanted to celebrate. So the first person to send me a selfie to at Uni of Trials of you playing one of these lessons, I'll send you a University of Trials shirt. Make sure you use the hashtag happy student and even if you don't win, I'd love to hear from you. <laughs> Now I don't usually class achievements as easter eggs but I thought that this one was pretty cool. If you open the world map and click at the locations I do, the credits will roll and you'll unlock an achievement. So the locations you click are actually the locations of Ubisoft Kiev's office and Ubisoft Red Link's office. 
Back before I became Captain Excellent and vowed to share the gift of video game easter eggs with the world, I used to watch a lot of Achievement Hunter Let's Plays, especially their Trials Evolutions Let's Plays. The best Trials player at Achievement Hunter was Jack Portillo, who receives a special thank you in the game's credits. As discussed, a lot of tracks have secrets if you reverse backwards at the starting line. One of my favourites can be found on El Tomate, where you can be carted away in a truck full of tomatoes. So in this next part of the video, I wanted to cover some of the secret squirrels you can find in the game. Of course, these aren't easter eggs, but some of them involve either a lot of steps to activate or are just downright cool. As mentioned, I won't be covering all of the squirrels, just some of my favourites. If you do want a complete list, then I'll leave a link in the description to a video guide. So the first secret squirrel I wanted to share is found on Light's camera action. To be fair, this entire level is pretty awesome, especially the part where you have to drive through a scene of a robot spider shooting. The next squirrel is on Canyon Crash and demonstrates just how inventive Ubisoft Red Links is at hiding these squirrels. See if you can guess where the squirrel is in this clip. So I'm not going to lie, this one took me ages to get. The next one is on Chinese cliffs, and it involves one of my favourite mechanics in the Trials games, setting your bike on fire to trigger a reaction somewhere else. Now this one is really cool, on the Grave of the Giants level at checkpoint 6, bail at the ramp and grab onto the demolition ball. As I've mentioned a couple of times now, going backwards at the beginning of levels can be sometimes more fun than going forwards. Take the beach bum level for example where you can crash a monkey bonfire. Onto another level that requires you to set your bike on fire. On the yet problem, you can launch yourself into the sky. This next one is really well hidden. On one man's trash, you can find a recreation of Peggle. See, I told you they were inventive. This final one is the trickiest one in the video. You need to bail from your bike and grab onto a chain, which is easy enough. Then swing between the closing door and grab the other chain. And that's the part I struggled with. Ah! 
So that's all I have for you today. I have no doubt there are loads more Easter eggs and secrets in Trials Rising. And if you guys have found any that you want me to take a look at, the best place to contact me, as I said, is on Twitter or Instagram. The link to both will be in the description. If you enjoyed this video, then a like is really appreciated. Thank you all very much for watching, and I'll speak to you all soon.